We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills. Because that challenge is one that we're willing to accept, one we are unwilling to postpone, and one we intend to win. I was very proud of the job that the three of us did uh, getting us to and from the moon. That trip is a very long and fragile daisy chain and the links are very fragile and, uh, and we were able to keep them all intact, do our jobs properly. But why some say the moon? Why choose this as our goal? And they may well ask, why climb the highest mountain? Why, 35 years ago, fly the Atlantic? Why does Rice play Texas? We choose to go to the moon. God, when uh, John F. Kennedy made that uh, famous speech, a man on the moon by the end of the decade, uh, I was uh, struggling with uh, equations of motion in the uh, test pilot school at Edwards Air Force Base, and the notion of flying to the moon was far beyond my ken. Nine, ignition sequence start. Six, five, three, two, one, zero, all engine. It's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. If there's any part of the flight of Apollo 11 that sticks in my memory, it is the memory of a little tiny thing that you can obscure with your thumbnail, blue and white, the white of the clouds, the blue of the ocean, just a trace of land, gorgeous, very shiny, bright background, uh, totally black. Uh, I, I will remember that all my life. Liftoff, we have a liftoff, 32 minutes past the hour. Liftoff on Apollo 11.